Of the Englishman who find this, his name is Frederick Catherwood, mm -hmm. 1841. Yes. So, almost a hundred years to find that jaguar that's in the inside. I mentioned on the coach that they find the jaguar in 1937. So if they find this in That's, that's where the spectators used to stand, right there. <clears throat> The spectators also used to climb up to the top. You know what Maya people use as pets instead of an iguana? Or a dog or a cat? Monkey. <laughs> Monkey. You can see the skull. And underneath the pole you can see, you know, underneath the skull you can see the pole we're talking about. Okay? Watch the movie, Apocalypto. And it'll show you all of this in vivid color, in great detail. You know? I'm not saying that the whole movie is true. Whenever Hollywood is involved, <laughs> half of it is false. But then again, the other half is very, very true. What I do... Uh, this one's a high class. Okay. And this one's a low class. What's the difference on this one and that one? Teeth. The teeth is a good answer, yes. But it's the forehead. Uh -huh. The one in the bottom, it's flat. And the one at the top, it's normal. If you have a normal forehead, that means you are a symbol of of nothing, you know. Here we go. This is how you would want to look like a thousand years ago. This is a big nose. But it is true. They get a prisoner of war. Everyone, if you don't mind, those of you on this side, squeeze on over here. It'll never fail. Listen carefully. Okay. I heard it. This is a language that's fading away day by day. Let's watch. Let's count 18. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, and 18.